Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. On today's episode, we'll be having bath time with the boys. So stay tuned and we will get started. Just wanted to tell you guys, if you enjoy my content, consider liking, subscribing, and hitting the bell notification so that you know when I post new guinea pig videos. So like I said earlier on today's episode, it is bath time with the guinea pigs. I uh, wanted to say really quickly that um, bath time is not something that guinea pigs need very regularly. It is something that they need maybe as little as once a year, honestly. Um, you would only do it in cases where they're really, really dirty, which doesn't happen too often because they're really good at cleaning themselves. But I like to do it yearly around the end of the summer just so that they can stay fresh for the remainder of the year. So I do it pretty much once a year. They're pretty good at keeping themselves clean. So the first thing that I would suggest is please don't give your guinea pigs weekly or daily baths. They don't need that. They need it as little as one time a year. So the reason I say one time a year is because guinea pigs skin is very sensitive. So if you bathe them too much, it can actually cause hair loss. It can cause dryness and itching on their skin. So that's why you definitely do not want to bathe them often. Like I said, once a year is fine. Unless they're very, very soiled, then you know you would do it at least one more time than that. But for the most part, once a year should be great. Also make sure that the weather is warm. It's a hot, warm day. You definitely do not want to give your guinea pigs a bath in the middle of winter because they can get sick and that would not be a good thing. Another tip that I would give you guys is to use a shampoo that is made for guinea pigs. You cannot, they cannot use human shampoo. It is too harsh for them. So make sure it's something that's safe for them that is uh, made specifically for you know, like rabbits or guinea pigs, and you should be fine. And the final tip that I would give you guys if you're giving your guinea pig a bath is to make sure that you dry them off completely. Have a towel handy just to make sure you can dry them off completely before putting them back into the cage. And that's pretty much all the advice and tips that I have for you guys when it comes to giving your guinea pig a bath. And with that, I'll just kick back, let you guys watch the remainder of the bath, and I'll check in with you at the end of the video. Actually, there was one more tip that I forgot to give you guys, and that is to make sure that you rinse them thoroughly. So make sure that you rinse them off where you don't feel any more suds on them. So that is very important that you make sure you rinse thoroughly. And with that, now officially, I have no more tips to give. So I'll just lay back, and let you guys finish watching the bath. Enjoy. So bath time is pretty much done. I wanted to take this opportunity to tell you guys that I appreciate your support. If you like this type of content, do consider liking, subscribing, and hitting the bell for more guinea pig content. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.